All the way up there. Ah! Oh! That's loud. That's really loud. If you just can uh, stop screaming, that would be great. That's the loudest shit I ever heard in my life. Hey, how's it going? I'm Freaky Perhaps, and welcome to Margarita. So this is a Swedish comedy horror game that's been requested to me by a viewer. Let's get straight into it. But before I do that, this guy has been annoying me for the past five minutes. I just want to smack him in the face. Nordic Productions, all right. Developed by Jordan Lindgren. Jordan Lindgren, I guess. <laughs> What am I getting? <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? What's your favorite sex position? Okay. Sweet, am I right? Where? We got the PewDiePie. Where am I? Hmm. Well, it looks like you're in some kind of a cell, but I feel like it's kind of the wrong type of cell. Because I need a dual cell to be able to play this long game. Need some goddamn energy. It's too dark, need a flashlight. Okay. Uh, should be a flashlight down here then? I think. Yeah, there is. Or. That's the toilet. Okay. Luckily, I didn't flush the to flashlight down the toilet. Okay. And the drain. This is very atmospheric. Very scary. Let's keep going here. What is going on? Where am I? Oh, what is this? Did I just put him in that position after he died already? What? What a weird position to die in a seemingly electric chair or something. With spikes in the back. Okay. Wow, wow. What is this oh. place? Indeed. David Jazz. Can we play some jazz on this radio, maybe? Oh, there's a key. Play something. Well. Greetings, traveler. My name is David Jazz. If you can hear this, and you are currently in the old sex chamber. Don't freak out. This pre-recorded message was made to help you survive this. I have statue tapes all around this dungeon that will help you escape this abnormally large sex chamber. Grab the key and find the door to the next room. Best of luck, traveler. <laughs> David mm. Jess, huh? Hmm. Okay, apparently we're in a sex chamber. Even though it doesn't look much like it. it looks more like a torture chamber for torturing skeletons. Which really doesn't work because they can't feel a lot of pain because they have no nerves. There's some very big rooms here. What am I going to do? Like open a door? Oh yeah, 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 key. I got a key. So open this door. Right. Open sesame. Okay. There we go. Speak to David. But who is he? On the radio, maybe? Greetings, traveler. It is me again, David Jazz. No sex chamber may look like some ordinary abnormally large sex chamber, but no, it is rather unexplored. So be cautious while looking around. Make sure to look under every nook and cranny, and keep an eye out for notes left from previous victims. There should be more tapes further out in the chambers. Good luck, traveler. <laughs> hmm. 
Look for notes. Okay. Okay, I don't think there's any notes in there at least, so... Let's keep moving. Oh. Is it lower? Oh yeah, I have a flashlight. <laughs> okay. It's a lot of cells down here. Is there, Is there anything written on there? No. Okay. Keep going then. What? Can I open this door? Yes, I can. And there are multiple doors like it. And I probably have to go into each and every one of them. I would think. There's notes. There. Hi, my name is Ted. Ted Williams. If you're reading this, you're probably in the same situation as me, or a cop, or a freak I hear screaming in the tunnels. I'm writing this note for three reasons. If you like me have found yourself trapped in here, I want to share my story with you, and hope that it can somehow assist you. If you're law enforcement, I hope this will give you insight in this case, let you know everything I had to go through, and hopefully help to give whoever is behind this the punishment they deserve. Lastly, I want to do this to stay sane. I need to put down my thoughts, or else I'll just walk around babbling to myself. Here goes nothing. I woke up here less than an hour ago. The last thing I remember was that I was drinking with some friends last night. My head still feels like it's about to push through my skull. At first I thought this was just another prank from my friends. They're like that. I thought they'd really just outdone themselves, getting access to some underground tunnel and hiring some guy to leave messages on the radio. But the longer the tunnels appear and the higher I screamed, I started to realize this is not a prank, this is real and I have no idea how to get out. Then I heard it. I voice unlike any human voice I've ever heard before. He's shouting things in these tunnels. I have no idea what he's saying. Sounds like an European language of some kind, but he does not sound friendly. I'll try to keep whoever you are updated later on. Please be careful, Ted. Alright. Oh yeah, audio. <laughs> the Swede is roaming in the halls of these sex chambers. And it does not sound friendly. What the hell are those cells used for? He told you earlier! Listen to the story, man! It is made for the dirty business of Mr. Ted here, or probably this guy wandering around. I was going to uh, look through everything, as he said. No. It was very important to uh, keep my eyes peeled. And look for stuff. Can I pick this up? Yeah, I can. Okay, nice. Okay. Nothing in there, nothing in there. What is this? Ah, it's a brick. Fuel canister? Can I pick it up? No? Blanks? I don't know. Oh, there's a bl blood. Okay. Or is it? It could just be paint. Right? Because the meat have deteriorated. Why haven't the blood? I don't know. I have no idea how this works. Electric. Do not fall in. Be careful. There we go. Okay, I found a key. Now to go back. And find a door. Where the key belongs. Well... It's a pissing bucket, buckets. Gonna have to do my business right now. Okay, there we go. Y'all can move on. <laughs> what? Uh, hello? Did it just turn off the lights? No. It's been dark like this. All game. See ya. Does the door key fit in this door? No. Will it fit in this door? Yes, it will. Okay, there we go. Open that. And keep walking. Keep checking behind us. And be careful so it doesn't slip on any cum on the floor. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh. Here we go. Who are you? 
Odin. Hide in there. Oh! I just got scared by shit. Well, in a sex dungeon, that, so, that shit should really scare you. Because you never know what fetish people have and if they want to shit on your face or not. Is a camera? Or no? That's an aligner. I think. There's nothing in here. Can I pick up this? Blow something up? I want to blow shit up. Come on. I want to blow, blow up that toilet. Did I just shut them? Just anything here? It's a map. Chamber map. Okay. Uh, I am... You are here. That means... This is... Uh, up, upside down. There's home. Down there. So this is where the guy lives. Run, Drew, come on! Break it down with your huge inch. Gluteus Maximus muscles. Small shoe. This shoe, weirdly enough, smells like an armpit. It is probably a reminder. Perhaps on the first one that was trapped in these tunnels. It wasn't a child. I have a feeling it doesn't belong to a child. Just a man with really small feet. Okay. And a really small toilet, apparently. And some kind of a wine glass that's weirdly invisible. You need to fix your uh, glass te textures. Okay, there we go. Space. I get it. Space does not work. Need to click a little bit faster, I guess. There we go. Easy. Space is a little bit slow with um, click, so yeah. I get it. Maybe this door is now open. Let's see what's down here. Oh, it's a... <laughs> Treasure! Treasure falling down on me, falling down on me, that better do. Rubber ducky, a rubber bucky. Rubber buck, the rubber duck, likes warm baths, long walks on the beach, and oatmeal. It's said to bring good fortune to whoever poops his adorable little beak. It's not. Bop, bop. I want to bop him. Come on, I want, I want good fortune. Baguettes! You want to my game? <gasps> Like, if you follow my Reddit, you will know. Baguette is my meme. Apparently. <laughs> Me and noob guys. Oh. Yes. What is that? Is there a pool somewhere? Somebody swimming? Can I have a peek, maybe? A swimming pool in a sex dungeon doesn't really make sense. Or does it? Very uh, wet sex. Greetings, traveler. Looks like you made it. Now, there should be an exit that you can crawl out of right behind that statue. Oh, okay. Ah! I wanted to slap him, not the opposite. How? How the hell did I get here? Ooh! Isn't, wasn't this used to be like raised up in the air and you had a girl dancing in there or something, right? I think so. Hi again, it's Ted. Ted Williams. I've seen him now. That man. That. Thing. I have no idea what the hell his deal is, but he doesn't feel keen on me leaving. I managed to get around him, and I don't think he knows where I am. But I can still hear him in the distance. Jagerhammer! What does that face even mean? What does it mean? You wanna go know, guys? You really wanna know? It's Swedish. I can translate. I'm from Norway. It's basically the same as Norwegian. I don't know if it will help, but I had to get through some sort of studio to get here. A bunch of easels and paints everywhere, and drawings of grown men and weird dreamish sequences. Does this freak see himself as some sort of an artist? Anyways, I'll also discover that he's a lot easier to trick and get around when he's distracted and provoked. I really hope this helps you, and best of luck to both of us. If I make it, I will make sure to leave some more notes. Thank God he did. 
didn't take my notebook when he trapped me in here. In case I don't make it, here's a little fact about me that might help you identify me. My name is Theodore Williams. I was born the 29th of February 2000 in Seattle, Washington. I'm a journalist student currently residing in LA and a part-time worker at a local cafe. My parents' names are Benjamin and Natalie Williams. God, I hope this information will not be necessary. Ted. Okay. Let's hope Ted will help us out of here. Or else I'm screwed. Literally. Just this. Yoyama! Or I'm home, apparently. Okay. So we have a little Swede running around in here. Do not tell PewDiePie. Okay, this is the labyrinth. Okay, I get it. Oh, if I can only find a way out without getting noticed. Okay, 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 okay. Where do I go? This way? Okay, up here. All the way through, right? All the way up here. Ah! Oh! That's loud. That's really loud. If you just can uh, stop screaming, that would be great. That's the loudest shit I ever heard in my life. So all I have to do is just light the bonfires and I'll get somewhere, hopefully. Okay, this is terrifying. I don't like this. It's so loud. It made me scream like a little bitch. Can I interact with this? Maybe split them in half or something with the bonf... Thor? That's crazy, it's so loud. I need to turn on the audio a little bit there. That's too bad. I can't keep running forever! I can actually... Okay. Good to know. I can actually hide while it's following me. It makes it a lot easier. Hey, stop, 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 stop. Okay, there. Okay, it's good. It's good. I'm safe. Hopefully. Okay, don't run then if he doesn't see me. Save up the stamina. Makes it a lot easier. But it is so slow! Like that. Okay, good. Now, pick this. Margarita. Okay, that's good. Grab that. Find the papyrus pit. Very easy. Okay, burn that. <laughs> Revenge! How unlucky is this life? Not in my house. Not in my chambers. Slow down, you hot kiss ass. You can't run forever. I tried to be nice, but you left me no choice. You could have been anything good. Okay, now it starts. Yes, I can stop you. It's saying open. You can't stop me, okay? In Swedish. <laughs> That's good. Now. For the next part. Of my mischievous plans of killing this guy. Rest the handcuffs. These cuffs have been rusted away and have seemingly been broken out of. Someone has been here before. Maybe the insane guy running around? It was Captain here. Hopefully. Maybe I should check that door first. Which door? There's two doors. This one. Okay, nah. Oh shit, no way I'm going through this. Damn right. Or we better just hide in the toilet again. Take another shit. There we go. Ah. Refreshing. Let's see, what's in. Nope, nothing there. Okay. This game is actually damn good, I must say. Can I go down here? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, of course. Stop the fire. What? <laughs> this is not safe. <laughs> this is dangerous. <laughs> oh, God, I'm dead. I'm, I'm so dead. Someone is gonna find me down here. As a skeleton like all the others.
Wake up. Come on. On your feet now. Yes. Last act broken. Well, that's not too bad because this, this is a game and not Maybe real life, so it doesn't really matter. Use those goons to climb up. Okay, maybe that one. Gonna jump over here. Maybe. Do I dare? Come on, come on. Nope. Maybe we can pick up all the skeletons. Like something, huh? No? Oh! Pick a bone. Okay, there we go. This will do. This will do. That bone. Okay, climb. Okay. Great. I'm up. I'm good. Ah, oh, another bone. Okay. This one? That will, that will do. On, throw me a bone here. What's over here then? Nothing. Climb up. Come on. Nice. This is just like the forest. Let's see if Cl rock climbing class has paid off. Rock climbing class. Okay. Building any kind of muscle always pays off. Greetings, traveler. It is I again, David Jass. And oh my, it seems like you've gotten yourself to a little bit of a pickle. But don't worry, traveler. I will help you out. You see the waterfall over there? What I want you to do is to swim right up. The waterfall is actually handmade, and it's supposed to work like a hidden elevator. And it'll suck you right up. <laughs> Anyways, continue on. And listen to my words. Good luck, traveler. I believe in you. <laughs> I'm supposed to swim up a goddamn okay waterfall. That's hard. Hope your climbing lessons works out. Made you the strongest man alive. Jesus. You need help. By Jesus himself. But I might as well try. Hello. Okay. Whoa, it sucked me in. Okay, that's. <laughs> Magic, apparently. Oh, it's dark. Am I submer submerged in water right now? Am I gonna drown? Oh, it's everything's blue. There we go. Beautiful. Blue color. There's another note. This is Ted Williams. I'm running out of ink, so I'll keep it brief. Apparently, puzzles are a thing now. I don't know if it's the freak or the radio man that arranged it, but there's some kind of hold lock here. I had to swim through some water to get here, so I hope it's a sauna or something. Process is that I found a Polaroid camera next to a TV I found nearby, so the future messages might have some visual assistance. I also think I found the freak's motivations to this. Apparently, his family fades. Due to ink loss, okay. Hmm, interesting. There we go. I open this chest, release it, and there. There we go. Okay, actually, I messed it. There we go. Come on. There, and last one, and there. And of course, there. Interact. There we go. Another one. A lighter. F to use lighter. Okay, there we go. Very easy. I don't have a flashlight anymore, so this is all I can do. I'm not complaining. I've seen worse in my life. Of the 50, 50 plus games I've played so far on my channel. Do I dare to go in there? Jump over. Okay, there's a code lock. Okay, nice. There, you can find a clue. There's the TV. And there's the code. That's too easy. There has to be something else. I don't know if the lighter actually runs out of uh, fuel, but um, it's a game, so I, I'll take my chances. There's a TV. Okay, I'm good. Morse code. Ah, it's easy. Five straight lines. That's zero, right? Five un underneath. That's five. Zero five two nine. Zero five two nine. Zero five two nine. Okay. There we go. Door unlocked. Nice. Let's keep moving. A toilet. Price money. Yes. I can poop again. 
for the third time in this playthrough, I can yeah. poop. Just like Mama used to make. Does it give you a diarrhea? Please. I need this. I need to shit again. For the content. Okay! Yeah. Oh, this is dark. But not as dark as the goddamn skeletons. Well, at least they died having fun, I guess. Policing themselves. With all the toys they have down in the dungeon. The sex dungeon. Okay. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. What? What did you say? Run? Did it say run? Up here is something, right? Oh, this is a creepy picture. Polaroid picture. No one will find your corpse, Ted. Okay. Oh no, Ted. Oh no, Ted indeed. Ted talks is dead. No need to save him. He makes so good content on the Ted Talks show. Oh, come on. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. I'm, I'm running. I'm going in. Uh, no. No. There we go. This is right. Oh, hammer, hammer. No. Go. Ah! I want to beat you so bad. Oh. Well. Yeah, he's definitely coming through there. I need to keep my stamina up though, so I can actually run from him. Or else I'm just gonna keep dying in a loop. And we all know I don't want that. Because I wanna finish this game. But what if I put my faith in there so you can throw tomatoes on me? Oh, Would you like that? Dead. Would you give me a gift then? Another toilet maybe? I would love that. Ooh. But for yeah, now, yeah, yeah. I will run from you. And there is nothing else I can do but run. Nothing else I can pick up, no? Just keep running. And running. Oh! Come on, under. Okay, good, good. I'm fair! I'm not programmed to crouch! <laughs> Come on. Please Funny. be a way out. <laughs> not programmed to crouch, okay. Me neither. But I can just slide because on the cutscene, I guess. Can I go in there? No. There we go. Keep going. Whoa. Ooh, uh, an upside down clock. Funny. Oh, yes. No more tunnels. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is not This is not a lot much, much, much better, okay? This is not a lot much, much better. This is a white house with a phone. It makes things a lot worse. Hello, this is your grandma Pringle Doof. I was wondering, do you by any chance know how to get Epic Victory Royale? No? Okay. Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> ah, kids nowadays love playing Fortnite. Very nice. Oh, 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 yes, it needs to get them. No, it's not. This room that feels familiar. It isn't the new Samsung G9. Come on. What? Did you do? Like, what is this? Like, uh, doot doot. Oh. What the heck? Epic sounds, dude. You ever thought of being a random musician? Nerf oh. pistol. What? I could do some real damage with this one. You could. Let's see. Can I break the monitor? And ah, this is this is garbage. No we'll figurine. This little guy puts a no in Naughty Boys. He looks like it would have a gnarly impression on both the protagonist and the antagonist in this story. <laughs> okay. This guy then. Jordan figurine. He puts the Ordi in Naughty. If there's someone ever making a game about this shit, this little Jesse 
fellow would probably be the great job of developing it. This is the developer, I guess. What is this? Is that a... Sh should I shoot that? Break this down. There we go. What do I put up there? Maybe this? Play that, maybe? Oh, that's epic. What do I do? Go watch TV again, maybe? Oh, it's on. Okay. I should play this, I think. Please stop. Very nice music, though. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay, there's no way of me stopping it, so... Well, well. Play that. What? Drums? What is this room? What am I supposed to do? Play drums? Woo! I got it, though. I got it. Okay. Should play the rest though, maybe? I can't. There's no way for me picking it up. Okay. Moving on to the next room. Turning off the light, apparently. Huh? Oh no, no. This is so much worse. Can I take up these barricades now? Okay. Then I got two doors. That's so much easier. This door is locked. Okay, that, one door then. What is this? A camera? Oh, okay, nah. No way. Okay, there's somebody dead in there. Go in. Knock on the door. Okay. Hello. Hello. Is there anyone out there? No. Oh, yeah, hi. Oh, my goodness, finally. I've been stuck here for so long. Grab on this key and try locking the door with it. I've kept this key for a while and I think it's the right one. Well, what if I don't? <laughs> it's the wrong key, okay. That sucks. That sucks. I'm going to die in here. I won't be able to survive much longer. What? A choice? Okay. In what way will you respond? Choose wisely. Reassuring, realistic, helpful. Let's try helpful. Are you entirely sure you looked everywhere? Maybe you missed something. You really think I even looked everywhere? <laughs> I've tried my best to get out of this place, but there's no escape at all. Hey, Go for realistic. On, I'm just trying to help. With that attitude, yeah, you're for sure going to die in here. I might as well kill myself. Hmm. Let's just make a quick work of that process, okay? Anything to progress the game, I guess. And now I can open this door, okay? Very nice. Can I climb back up? 
Nope. Okay. Let's keep moving. Oh, mannequins. Serious. Oh, great. Mannequins. At least they look great. Look beautiful, I guess. Oh, hey, beautiful. Should I stand there or should I run? I have no idea. I have a crowbar though. That's a weapon, apparently. Yeah, okay, no. You good? You great? Okay. Wait, something's off. Yeah, something is, something's definitely off. And that, my friend, is all the lights. They are off. Okay. I wanna see. I want to go back. I need it. What happened here? Nothing. Yeah, nothing. Okay. Weird. Oh, come on. Faster. I know there's a jump scare coming. Or maybe not. Oh. Okay. Crowbar. Come on. The sensitivity is awfully high, I must say. Okay. Okay. A light show! Hey! I'm an artist and this... This is my work. I really hope you'll enjoy it. Because I've spent so much time and energy developing... Expressing something that I, I, I really want to express. I, I like to work with my hands to... Feel hmm. the material I'm working with. Feel with my fingertips. <laughs> Warm blood. I, 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 what I meant to say was that I like to express pain with my art. If they deserve it, and they do, <laughs> what they did, what he did, I miss my father so very much because he made me the artist I am today. It's all because of him. Everything is. I never like color. It doesn't feel like home to me. I like working with shadows. Hmm. In the shadows. Whoa. He's an artist, that's really good. Really good. Well painted. What's this? Okay. Moving on. We're in the death chamber. Don't want to be there too long. Or else I will end up just like the rest of the guys. Please. You gotta get me out of here. Please, anyone, help, help. <laughs> I drop a lot. Jazz? What? That's right. David Jazz at your service. Jazz? Oh, thank God. You need to help me out of here. I will certainly try, Traveler. But this door seems incredibly secure. If you only had some explosives or something. Oh. <laughs> well, there's plenty of chemicals and stuff in here. Maybe I could do something with those. Brilliant! Maybe you have what is required to make some blasting do. You're gonna need this, this, and also these two. But hurry okay. before no one catches up to you. Okay. <sighs> okay. Pen till powder, linseed oil, and some... I don't know, can I pick up everything or just something? I don't know. Let's see here. Look quick, come on! I can do this. Ah, oh, need to be fast. There's no time to waste. Pick up whatever that is. I have no idea. Just gonna pick it up. Bread, okay. And some oil. There we go. Plant explosive. Okay, come on. Did it. This is so easy. Can I call somebody? I got a last phone call to my girlfriend or something. Tell her that I love her if I die. Standing too close to this game. Explosives, okay. If that was plastic explosives, I would be dead. 
Oh, look at the shit. graphics. We made it. Language? But yes, you did it, Traveler. Oh, cool. thank you so much, <laughs> David. Thank you so much. So how do we stop this son of a bitch? Look out! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a meatball. Okay. <laughs> oh. Margarita. You're safe now, child. <laughs> what is going on? Is the meatball a god? That's not a meatball though, but okay. <laughs> no. But Papa, I really like Do you. not talk back to me, boy. There's no love in you boys kind. What do you mean? They are seducing you, polluting your brain. You don't love them. They just want you to think that, but they can never love you. Promise me, boy, that if any one of them fags ever make you feel for them, that you punish them, because that is what they deserve. They deserve to be punished. Do you understand, boy? Do you understand? Yes, father. I understand. I promise. Based on a true made-up story. <laughs> okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to know when I'm uploading. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day. I'm walking around in the circle of life. Doing the things I know.